I got a bit. I got a bit. Hello, everybody. Welcome. Treats. Part tray. Empty box. Don't need that right now. All right, so. <laughs> my youngster. The goat of the channel. The one that carries everything. Me. Yeah. It carries I everything. All this. I take credit for all of your, all of your stuff. He's 18 success. next week, by the way. He's 18. All right. So I'm not going to have any more children starting next week. That'd be great. All right. You're out. Move out. All right. So here's the deal. Treats. If you guys want to go for this, look, it's it's a lot of fun. Kind of cool to be surprised. And this is kind of cool because this one is Serbia and Croatia. Cool thing about this is, is that my father-in-law that passed in March is has his... Uh, heritage from Croatia. Kind of really cool to have a Croatian uh, box. So you get the little card in there. Talks about it's like a little postcard that they give you, right? Um, here we have a little explore Serbia and Croatia. Some fun facts and did you know stuff. Gives you even a Croatian dessert or meal or something like that. Let me know what, uh, if anyone's ever tried Seva Pisisi. <laughs> whatever it is but it looks kind of good so you got that you got your little card kind of tells you what the what the goodies are you know what i do i put them up on the screen it looks like they have a little uh giveaway going on right here and so you can actually do this and uh get a discount if you mention larry's hair in your order for your coupon code to get 15 percent off on your first order and look I don't think many people or anyone's really taking me up on it, but it's like, you ought to give it a try. Not because I need, you know, any commissions or anything like that, but it's legitimately kind of fun and exciting to get the next, next treat box in. And they've offered kindly to uh, be a kind of a sponsor for the channel. But again, they sought me out and I'm kind of glad they did because this has been kind of a lot of fun. So without much further ado, Let's go ahead and jump into the first snack that we have on hand, which is Animal Kingdom Milk Chocolate. Kind of read the description there. A little, uh, little panda action. All right, so we're going to go ahead and give this a shot. You ready? We've got a lot here because there's a lot of big stuff here too. Remember the, uh, what's it called, on the last box? It had the, was it like squid or something inside of it? Remember? Oh. No, it was, sea, it. it was seaweed, and he was acting like he was digging it and no, stuff. Go look at the last it video. Was, uh, it was something seaweed. It was like it was like a, a sea creature. What was oh, it? the squid. It was like a yeah, it was like squid seaweed. Who goes to Seven Eleven and goes? Let's see, Starburst. There's M and M's. Ooh, squid. They got squid. <laughs> really? It's pretty bad. All right, so we're opening it up here. A little uh, chocolate action. We're gonna pace ourselves by small little 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 pieces here. Oh, that's gone. Been destroyed. All right. You ever have those um, Easter eggs during Easter? They're yeah, all they're hollow. It's, that. it's exactly that. It's, that yeah. it's exactly that. A little I'm piece. Good. Yeah. yeah. All right. So mm. good one. Going, they can get a whole cheat like Easter bunny, chocolate or whatever for a couple of bucks. I don't know if the I don't know what these even cost. If they're like a Less than a buck. Yeah, great. But typical milk chocolate. Yummy yum. All right. So next stack we have here. Really, this is going to be kind of like, do I really need to try a pretzel? Hey, have you ever had a pretzel before? No. Oh, well, then let me let you have one then. What here we go. Called? What is it called? The name they're... They're oh, they're prima, pretzels, but they, yeah, it's just pretzels. Thing, but these okay. aren't the ones that are uh, these aren't the ones that are uh, dipped in chocolate though. Those are the we've had two of those so far. So far, both of these are just normal food. That, yeah, so that, far it's that, like that American stuff, but not a big deal. Pretzels you know what this tastes like? Not, what pretzel? <laughs> it tastes like a pretzel. <laughs> All right, so far, so American. All right. Oh. Not that, not that surprising yet, but we're moving on. Smoky. You know, well, show it to them first, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> a little lover, a little love, a little love. Fresh baked peanuts. Those do not look like peanuts. But, okay. Oh, okay. I mean, they look like they're, no? Over. Whatever, we can do it, huh? Yeah, you see? 
They're like uh, what? The, it's like shrimp. Not shrimp. They're like, it looks uh, like shrimp. They're like uh, Cheetos. Ooh. You know what it's like? Interesting. It's like a, it's like pirate's booty. <laughs> it's like pirate's booty. Like yeah, it's like pirate's booty. booty. But you know what it's like? It's like <laughs> eating um, it's okay. like eating a peanut butter flavored Cheeto. <laughs> no. No? No. Oh, yeah, the aftertaste. I don't know. I like it. No, I like these. It's like a peanut flavored Cheeto. That's really weird. All right. Okay. Moving right moving right along. So far, nothing that's really catching my eye of going, ooh, that's kind of an interesting cultural kind of thing like I've had before. But now we're going to go with Kiki. Kiki! Tootie Verdi. These kind of look like Starbursts. Yeah. All right. Let's open it up. There you go. Here's your Kiki. Wrapped like a Starburst. It says Tutti Fruity. Probably tastes like a Starburst. Let's take a look. See a little, little uh, piece here. Looks like we've got some... It's uh, some a Starburst. That's what it is. It's going to be a Starburst. <laughs> All right. So let's give this a shot. This must be a strawberry. Ooh. Looks like a Starburst. Starburst. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Starburst, but yeah. No but. It's Starburst. I think anything chocolate is gonna taste the same as American. Well wait. It has like a yeah, you I was just yeah. <laughs> at the same yeah. time. Yeah. It's like a what's it called? Like a mm. like a Mexican like you know I'm like you know like Mexican candy? Yeah. It's like a Mexican candy. Yeah, yeah, it had a little a little delayed flavor to it. Still very starbursty. This is kind of let's just kind of call it that. Okay. So the next one we got Banana Co. Banana Co. Banana Co. Is that your banana Co. It's got a banana on it. Here, let me just peel the banana. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how weird! Hang on a minute. Oh, this is weird. This is weird. Okay, hang on a minute. Here, take that piece. Now, this is different. Well, that's really good. Oh, that's my good. gosh. That's really good. Mm. <laughs> that's really good. That's crazy. It, the initial taste tastes like something from Easter. Peeps. Oh, what is that? That's good. Here. No, I'll take it. Well, I'm just going to put it back in the bag. Mmm, that's really, really good. Mm. Okay, something I've never tasted before. It has... I'm trying to put my finger on what I'm thinking of that's like an Eastery kind of treat, but I can't come, I can't come up with it. Um... Doesn't even really taste like banana, does it to you? Yeah, it's like banana. Doesn't to me. It tastes, it tastes different, but that's good. Ooh, yeah. that's really, really good. I give that a nine. Yeah, a solid nine. All right. Very cool. Okay. Euro cream block by Takavo. Okay. So again, it looks like we have just a a Euro cream bar. Milk, and chocolate product with hazelnut. Do you like hazelnut? Bro, I'm allergic to nuts. Some, I'm not allergic to nuts. Some tree nuts get me sometimes, not gonna lie. Yeah, well. You're just nuts, period. Alright, here you go. With hazelnut, that's kind of like the creamer that you sometimes use for your coffee. Mm. Alright. Good. So, mm. it's kind of like a little sandwich kind of guy. That's got the the hazel be, hazel between. Hmm. Again, go get some water. Go get some Hmm. This reminds me of like a German kind of a German chocolate kind of kind of bar. This is really good. I like that. 
Wow. Okay. Man, more to go. All right. So we're going to look at Darina Chocolate by Crass. There we go. Kicks. Let's see. Milk chocolate with biscuits. Biscuits. Little biscuit things in there, right? All right. So this might be like a kind of a form of um, like a like a like a Kix mm. or Twix. Yeah. There we go. Oh yeah. <laughs> there we go. Look at the consistency of that. <laughs> if that doesn't look good, if that doesn't get you, nothing will. All right. Let's try a small piece of this. There you go. Thank you, sir. You're welcome, ma'am. It's all right. <laughs> I don't know if the... Uh, I don't know if the... If the little... You know, biscuit things in there really add anything to it. It just tastes no. like a chocolate bar with like a little bit of a yeah. texture crunch. Yep. Like you slipped in just a flavorless kind of cracker in there or something like that. And it just, you know, it just kind of adds, I guess, to the experience of eating chocolate, I guess. I don't know. All right. But for me, the flavor of it, it's dialed. Like these last few that we've been on here, uh, I, I'm, I'm digging it. Okay. So, Keston dessert, Keston chestnut by Poinar. Poinor. Poiny? Poiny? Poinor? All right. So, let's see. Got a big thing thing over there, too. Okay, now, here we go. Little, little look, see? As to what that looks like. Ooh, that's kind of an interesting little inter in middle piece. Look at that. It's like, I don't know. <laughs> Look at me like that. <laughs> I don't think he likes it. Okay, as long as I don't like it, here's the thing with chocolate mm. though, right? It's like, chocolate's one of those foods where you only can have like a little bit of it, and then it gets like old. Like, it's like, it's too sweet, you know? So it's like... This is very it's rich. Like it's like, alright. This is like that cream filling... When I was a kid, they used to have real Easter eggs with like the, like a white cream kind of like chalky kind of center, and it tastes. It reminds me of that. Mm. Yeah, I'm starting. I'm starting to pick up on some after flavors on this one. Yeah, it must be. It must be the chestnut. The chestnut's definitely coming through as an aftertaste. Ooh, I like that. Ooh, it's even building in flavor for me. You? No. You don't like it? <laughs> no, like it's not building in flavor. It's just, yeah. Oh, I like it. No. <clears throat> okay, guys. Let's continue on. We got uh, we got two more. Eugenia Original by Dabrogia. Dabrogia. Do you really want to eat something that rhymes with... Well, forget it. Dabrogia. <laughs> All right. Eugenia Original... Uh, biscuiti, cu multa, crema di acaco. That's that you means that, that that means I have no idea what this says. Oh, okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I don't want the whole thing. So here you go. Take a piece. Don't give me all. No, switch. I don't want that much. Well, yeah, I don't but... want that much either. No, don't give me. <laughs> all right. Hmm. Hang on. <laughs> okay. If I go the rest of my life without having another one of these, I'd be just fine. Not great, in my opinion. I mean, it's got just kind of a. It's mid. It's, it's got a real strong 
chemically taste to it to me. Does it feel taste chemically like you're you're eating like a ball of paint? No, it's like the consistency of it of like the crackers like. But I'm getting like a, this 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 aroma or this palate flavor of paint. Like I just ate a a thing that has paint in it. <laughs> I'm sure it can't be good for you. I just keep eating it. Okay. All right. You got to have one flop in the box. That's our flop. Okay. Euro flavor flavel <laughs> Euro flavor by Tocavo. Look at that. Just basically a wafer. A wafer. Yeah. Fuck a wafer. <clears throat> Let's see how this goes. Ooh. Okay. Got to be gentle on this one. We could have some problems here if we're not gentle. There you go. Normal wafer. Mm. Wafer. What does this taste like? Wafer. Wafer. <laughs> yeah. Normal wafer. Okay, so. Okay. This box, I'll give, like, I love chocolate. So I'm going to have to give it an eight just because I dig like milk chocolate. So I'd say that's that's a good that's a good that's a good box for me. That's a good one. A couple of them are like, yeah, you know, not all that great. But overall, the thing that's cool about this is that you know, you get your kids together, you you know, break open a box, you know, maybe you dare people or have just a a fun time just rating some of the food from around the, from around the world. It's really a cool little thing. And like I said, you get 15% off if you order it. If you don't, no big deal. Um, it's not, you know, my source of income. But heck, you know, it's kind of neat. I'd seen other people do reviews of these boxes before, and I've always been kind of intrigued. And when they reached out to me to offer to have us take a look at it and give it a try and get on their, get on their situation, it's like, yeah, let's do it. So... Looking forward to the next uh, box, see where that one might come from. Um, always fun to kind of get people together and you get an anticipate to have a little little treat from somewhere <laughs> you've never been to, right? Who wouldn't love that? So anyways, thank you, son. Yes, sir. I know you're a very busy man <laughs> and to get you on the screen is a very difficult task. No, not at all. But no. Is there anything else to say to the to the people? Box, scale, one to ten. Oh, it was like, listen, it was like an eight. I say a solid eight. The banana one was probably the best, but... Yeah, it's buried in there but somewhere. Yeah, but I that was a good say one. Something real quick before you end, right? Okay, so you're coming. Up on, okay, hold on. So he's coming up on sixty thousand subscribers. Okay. Okay. Wait. 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 Shut up. Wait. 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 Shut up. Hold on. Thank you know, all fifty-nine thousand nine hundred and <laughs> however many right. of you are there so far. I can't believe that since September, really, sixty thousand people to watch this guy listen to music and eat snacks. Yeah, that's that's insane. But I do want to say first off, it, it's crazy to see that you're about to hit 60k. That's insane. Like when when he first started his YouTube channel, he was reacting to uh, an artist called Aurora, and um, I kind of told him I was like, Dad, like you really have to like listen to like Eminem, like young people music, and like the younger generation. Well, Emma, uh, Aurora was she was right. more obscure. She wasn't like a huge audience kind of drawer but it's like i was yeah. never i've never been into this for it's look i did it as a eh. just for fun yeah, yeah just, just like a, like try it out for family or whatever and they just have a couple friends look at it and now i've got sixty thousand friends you know that's awesome sixty thousand. so congrats that's that's impressive it's really impressive so you guys are impressive that's insane the fact you guys are slamming this so the sub like you know me I do not ask for clap that like button or hit that subscribe button. You guys are all adults. If you like the content, you'll subscribe. If you don't, you don't, you know. But um, just to see um, where this has gone and where it's going to go, I have no idea. I'm really in it just to – I have selfish reasons. Be a multimillionaire. Let's just be real. Yeah. You know, yeah. Pop right. off. So when I pop I'm off, he'll you. be rich. <laughs> but it's just been a thing where um, – yeah, it's just been just for fun, you know, and um, I don't know, you know, if this is going to be like a, 
a full blown constant thing. It I'm hoping be. it will be. Um, I'm not gonna. Once I start to feel like it's work, and I've got a dread doing it, I'll probably check out or maybe give it a break, you know, or step away from it. But right now, I'm just really enjoying the community. I'm enjoying the pause haters. I'm enjoying <laughs> the the occasional troll that swings through to visit and say hi. Um, but really, at the end of the day, um, I am eternally humbled by the fact that there's this many people of you that enjoy the channel, that um, that look forward to it, and I so enjoy our community and interacting with each of you, and I'm so appreciative. And uh, awesome. got this kid to thank. You know, he's the one that kind of steered the ship. So, anyhow, anything else you have to say before you? Uh, go and no, stop just, embarrassing just, me no embarrassing you no it's just <laughs> congratulations and it's a big milestone and i mean just keep on going you know 100k is going to be the next i'm telling you we'll see we'll 100K. see we'll see one day at a time i just appreciate all of you and uh we will see you very soon on the next one and perhaps we'll go live we should go live soon yeah maybe we'll yeah. Go, should we go live tonight i keep on telling him that he should go live and like screen record his screen and like do things on his live and Maybe react to some stuff. Not well, I'll have to. Yeah, we'll have to figure out how to actually. <clears throat> it's hard to kind of um, fiddle around with live to see how to get all the screens and stuff working without going live. Because who wants to see me fumbling trying to <laughs> share a video? But maybe yeah, we can probably do something where we can do a live song reaction together um, and do something like that. But you feel like going live tonight? If we give them a little uh, heads up, either tonight or another night. Yeah. Well, another night would work, right? Because that could be uh, any time in the future within the next thousand years. Oh. So, um, yeah, I mean, if you got nothing going on, maybe we can just go live for a little bit. Yeah, possibly. What do you yeah. think? Possibly. Possibly. See this kid? Oh, possibly. Yeah. Right. He's got a girlfriend. You know, don't need to say any more. It's possible. Yeah. <laughs> like, whenever someone says that to you, don't like, if you're, if you're RCP like that, with a maybe, it's like, don't maybe, maybe like I'll that, be there though, unless <laughs> something else comes up that's more uh. more fun. Uh, don't make it look like that all right well anyways <laughs> thank you guys again for everything uh appreciate each and every one of you and we will catch you next time on the next video reaction take care